And, uh, yeah, I thought today was a pretty good practice. Uh, yeah, I thought guys came out with you know great energy. Uh, you know, I thought there was good, good competitive work. Uh, you know, obviously there was high emotions. Uh, you know, as we went into it, which you know I'm, I'm hopeful to see. Um, and we're continuing to work on just the control in those situations. I saw some guys that you know in the earlier part of practice maybe maybe lost control of a reaction or or a response and and. To see them finish the way that they did, uh, it was definitely a positive step. And so, I mean, that's what that's what happens in this game. I think one of the things that uh, has been a, a challenge for us at times throughout the course of the season is that you know, something doesn't go the way we want, or you get you know you, the frustration sets in for the for the moment. Oh, it's still about the details, still about the the, the the discipline, it's still about going and just being the best you in your response. And and so you've got to continue to see that. And uh, you know, I thought there were good examples of that today. And you know, I thought we got thought we got better with the work. I mean, it's. Uh, I mean, ultimately, you got. We don't have a choice. I mean, and you know, everybody can talk about what you you want to be individually, what you want to be as a team, what you you know, what your desires are. But that's not gonna. I mean, yeah, we found a situation nobody wants to be in. Right? Now, there's no. That's pretty evident. But we still all have desires of who we want to be and what we want it to look like. And so we get to make the choice of that. And if we're just driven by circumstance, that when it's all good, that you can. Oh, now I'm gonna work hard. No, oh, that's not. That's not right. Right, you know, we get knocked on our butt three times. I mean, it's we haven't played good. We haven't done the things necessary, but you know, we got opportunity for today. And if it's true in your core of who you want to be, go get better. Right, go show that you are better. Go, you know, take the steps that are necessary. And we sit around and feel sorry for ourselves, but nobody cares. And like it, it doesn't matter. Go show it. Show it in the work. Show it in how we prepare. And then, damn, they will need to make sure that it shows up on game day. What does Cal do on defense? Why do they generate? Yeah, they are uh, very multiple in what they do. Um, you know, front you know, coverages they mix as good as you know, probably anybody anybody played up at this point this year. Um, you know, they do a, a really nice job of uh, um, you know just the effort, the passion, the you know the energy. They are a big, long, physical defense. Um, they got you know good playmakers. So I mean, they've done a they've done a really nice job, and and uh, you're putting together a, a defense that plays to a to a standard. And uh, you know those guys have been very opportunistic with uh, with when that ball's in the air to, to be able to uh, not only you know create uh, you know, deflections and PBUs, but I mean creating those those interceptions. On the other side of the ball, what stands out about the Cal rushing offense? They've been really good these games. Yeah, you know they uh, they're, they're multiple in what they do. They're uh, you know, I think their backs. Uh, your quarterback's a good decision maker, and, and you know you can see them getting into good good calls as well. If, uh, uh, so I think he you know he does a nice job. They've got uh, uh, you know a good group up front. You know I think all 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 areas you know help contribute to that. You see some of the explosive runs and you know guys working down the field. So uh, uh, you know it's it, it's going to be one of those games that you know, we got to be on point because uh, you know, this is a rushing attack that uh, has given given uh, the teams trouble. And uh, you know obviously we got to make sure we're taking care of our responsibilities and. And doing it in an elite standard. Is it more challenging knowing that this is the first time you've ever had to encounter with the Gals? No, I mean, you know, it, it happens, uh, you know, just throughout throughout years. I mean, this is the first time that, uh, we, that we get to play them, and uh, you know, you, you, you obviously we respect every, the things that you see on film, and that's one of the things we talk about when when, when you're playing somebody, you know, you know uh, they respect what you put on film, and. Uh, you know, I mean, that's a, that's a challenge. Like, I've got a lot of respect for this team by how they play. Um, you know, you can tell they're very well coached. You can tell they're they, uh, uh, you know, they're, they're tough, they're physical, and, and they, they play with uh, with a, uh, a great deal of energy. Are you getting a good feel, maybe you and DJ each, for what happens in practice, what happens in games, what you need to do to, to get things done right in practice so it does carry over on Saturdays? Yeah, I mean, I think it's a, it's a it's a it's a feel from the entire offense, you know, and obviously DJ has. Uh, uh, has to, to, to help that transition uh, for him individually, um, you know, and you know, offensively, you know, we've got to we've got to make sure that we're doing that. Um, so that's, that's something that we're definitely working uh, to to make sure to have a you know, even a heightened sense of awareness to the detail and you know some things that we've you know, even you know, we've kind of you know, say taking things out, but you know try to be you know for for different positions, you know we've tried to you know even simplify you know whether it's a you know, a detail and route, or it's a, it's something to, to make sure that we are doing the things that are necessary to go and, and achieve success. And uh, you know, at the end of the day, you know, we've got to see that we've got to have a sense of urgency to to, to that. And uh, you know, we've got to have a lot of competition in each, each position for the guys to show consistency and, to, and for that to, to show up on game day. What do you like about um, seeing Jeremiah Byers on the the You know, I, I've I've been really impressed with him, and you know, I think 
when you, you talk about leadership, um, you know, you want to see, but who is the one who cares? I mean, who really cares about beyond just themselves? And it's been unfortunate, you know, JB being out for the last couple of games. Uh, but if, if you want to see something impressive, go watch it. Go go back and watch the, the, the video and watch him on the sideline. I mean, he's had a you know, leg injury, and not one time have I seen him sitting down on the bench. He has been active. He's been up and down the sideline, encouraging, challenging, pushing. Um, you know, we're, we're excited about, you know, getting him back on the field, um, you know, but that's what a leader is. And, you know, he could do anything physically to be able to help us, but man, he's trying to bring everything that he has. Uh, you know, he's very active today in practice. You hear him, you feel him, you see him, um, you know, you're really excited about, uh, you know, his, his continued steps and, and, he, and, and the push up himself. And that's where I think it all starts. How big can that game be for Malik's development? Not just the lone catch, he had a really contested first down catch. I guess a third down third catch down, in, yeah. that, in that second half. It, it, it was a big play. Coming yeah, out. you know, I mean, he's, you know, I think Malik is, is a guy that can be can be a great weapon for us. Um, you know, I think there's, you know, even in in that game, you know, for what he was able to do, uh, it should definitely boost his confidence. But then you also, um, you know, the, still with the challenge of of how it it could have been better and it could have been a lot better, uh, you know, throughout the, throughout that game. Um, and that's somebody that you know, I, I thought today, you know, his energy, his you, you could see him trying to apply to the detail. You could see him trying to to be, you know, a, a technician in that. And um, you know, I'm, I'm I'm grateful I got a chance to coach him, and uh, you know, just want to see him continue to, to take those steps because I think that can definitely be a spark for him. Do you see it coming with Hakeem too? I, I do, and you know, Hakeem got his first game back. You know, was able to do um, you know a few things out there. You know, still getting himself. You know, he missed about a month and so I mean you know still got to get himself back into that uh, that game ready shape you know I, I thought he did a wonderful job in his rehab to, to get back for uh, uh, for last week but uh, you know, I think we're gonna see him continue to to ascend and uh, you know, I thought he had a, a good day today and he's really pushing Danzi and Elijah Moore that they earned I guess the opportunity you know to it's it, uh, you know I think those are things that you know there are a lot of guys in that in that freshman class that I have zero doubt that the the type of player that they are going to be here and you know it is it is seeing them you know in practice you know the confidence and alignment assignment you know where what what to be able to do to be able I mean you know I mean Makai Danzi's made some great plays I mean you know we've got we've got a bunch of guys that have, have come out but you know in that moment when when to be able to to, to translate that to you know when a coach is not there to kind of you know, be there to support you in it um, you know it's those are the things that we're looking for the consistency in that uh, but you're know, definitely excited about those guys and you know there, there's a handful of a handful of those freshmen that we're that we're pushing and uh, you know I mean ultimately I don't I don't have any decisions on anybody that right now saying oh hey this guy's you know, we're just gonna play him in four you know if, if a guy can get out there and help this football team we are going to push it and I think there will be a group of guys that however many games that might be um, are gonna get get an opportunity so uh, you know, just need to need to, to, to see that and to see the to see the confidence you know in the in you know the communication the execution the details the, you know all, all those things uh, to be able to go make an impact we're good thanks go